is a dubious distinction, but you could uh, make the argument that Palmview is probably the, the largest suburban area without a wastewater collection system in Texas. The alternative currently in place, raising health and financial concerns. Yeah, but as Channel 5's Christian Von Pricing reports, relief is on the way. Thousands of people living in Palmview are using septic systems, and that will change. But for now, progress comes at a cost. Roads in Palmview have looked like this for a while now. A $42 million wastewater improvement plan is underway, but for now, the neighborhoods are a mess. I've been fighting with the mud for a year and a half, says Valdemar Garcia, inside and outside his home. He's one of the thousands of Palmview residents that have a septic system in their homes, and he and others say they're tired of the problems that come with it. They get clogged, he says. And when the area floods like it did in June, septic systems can cause another kind of problem. City manager Leo Olivares says the floodwaters have tested high for waterborne illness, and it's bad for attracting businesses to the city. Then you tell them they need to get a septic permit. They kind of have second thoughts, so they move to Mission or down the road, and, and we've lost out on that investment. The plan overseen by the water utility, Agua Sud, is happening in phases. The utility is laying the wastewater grid under the roads, and that's scheduled to finish in February. But then you still need to connect it from the, pro from the public right-of-way to the pro on private property. Those are the service lines. The EPA will be paying for as many as 1,700 homes to connect from their yard to the main line on the road. I hope it's done soon, says Garcia. He's looking forward to not having to deal with this mud anymore. The final goal is to connect Palmview's wastewater to the city of Mission, where it'll be treated. Palmview says the road work is gradually wrapping up and will be paved over the next coming months. In the studio, Christian Von Pricing, Channel 5 News at 10.